Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So we're doing Winter of Woe Part 4, and this is the last objective. Hopefully you've seen me do the first two. All right, I used Guillotine 2099 for the first uh, one. Then I used this one here, Deathless Guillotine, for the second one. And for this last one, I'm going to be using Nightcrawler. And I was actually excited to do this because I've always liked Nightcrawler. Even before his buff or anything like that, I liked him. Now, there's a chance to get a seven-star Nightcrawler, but they've made it a little annoying, so I may not do it. Um, but we'll see. They may give you another way of getting some of those, uh, the currency that you need. Now, I got excited when I saw someone do this with Nightcrawler. When I saw that he could actually meet the objectives. And you're going to see why. Now, you can see my Nightcrawler is a little baby Nightcrawler. Okay? But watch him. Watch him go. Look at this. Look at that. Look at that. All right? And then I tried to, and she just held her block. Now, I wanted to test that out. Look at my health. My health is like, blah. But I wanted to test that out. Look at look at him. Look at him bamfing. Just bamfing. Okay. But he makes evading her special much, much easier. Okay. There's not a whole lot. Now, sometimes that'll happen. The input will still drop. But... It is so much easier with him. And you're going to see that. Now, again, my Nightcrawler, six-star rank three. I have a seven-star um, Storm Pyramid X that I could have used. Mm -mm. I was determined to have fun with Nightcrawler on this one. I ain't care about, um, you know, how many revives I was going to use or anything like that. I wanted to do this with Nightcrawler. Okay. So here we go. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. A lot of that was him helping me. Okay. I just have to remember to actually evade early. Now, I don't know how to use him uh, since his buff, but I know you want to build up the prowesses. And then he has his precision. Look at that. Look at that. So my damage is really coming from the um, recoil. And I was determined not to turn that off. But look at, look at how much smoother this is. And of course, I still keep hitting like that into her block, trying to get her to fight. And see, when she hits into my block, a lot of damage. Okay? I think hitting into my block is way more than my um, recoil. So look at that. Just look at that. And then she intercepted me. She said, oh, you want to act like that, huh? I was like, all right, you got it. You, you got that one. That was, that was, that was good. I was, I was starting to get cocky. I was starting to feel myself. I was like, yeah, yeah, I can evade your special. You ain't nothing. And that's when she kicked me in the face. Lesson learned. All right, well, so I'm like, all right, well, let's go back in. You know, like I said, I'm not trying to uh, get a solo. And I just said, let's, let's just try to get her down and let's have some fun, okay? Just look at this. Woo, woo. Now, he didn't have a lot of prowess, and he didn't have a lot of the uh, precisions, but it's all good. All right? So we're not getting a lot of crits is what's happening. All right, here we go. Yep, mm-hmm, yep. Look at that. Beautiful, beautiful. And then I keep, because she just, look at it. You see how I'm backing up, and she's just walking at me? And if I try to attack her, she'll just block. Very annoying, because she knows I got her now. You know? So I'm just like, all right, all right. Look at this, look at this, look at this. Nice! 
Just lovely. And I don't want to accidentally switch either. Now see, right there, she hit into my block some. And I got out of some of it. And I don't know why it wasn't moving. And then look at it, see? I'm like, what is going on? Suddenly, she just like, bam. She's like, no. I'm just gonna keep on coming and, and hit you. And then there you go again. I'm like, ooh, that's so frustrating. I'm like, stop being so passive. So we're, we're still going, we're still going. And she's got, look at that. We jumped on her, that's good. All right, here we go. Evade, evade, uh-huh, uh-huh, yeah. I didn't see any evade pop up, so I actually did that. That's so you know, okay? Look at this, now I'm down to 2%, 1%. Now watch this, evade, evade, whoa. Now, had I actually gotten hit, I wouldn't have even made it to that last one, but I was already gonna go down because of my, um, because of the poison on me. But I had fun, I had fun with that, right? So I'm like, all right, let's keep going. She's almost gone, she's almost gone. And just a little bit of behind the scenes, I am eager to move on to another game that I play. And it's late at night at this point in time. And I'm like, okay, we gotta get this done. But I didn't realize that I had done this very early. I got this done like a week early. Um, and I'm like, well, I shouldn't say a week early, but given how I normally do these, I was surprised. I still had another week in some when I got this done. So I'm like, all right. Well, may as well get it done. Now, see, I switched. So I'm in swashbuckling right now. I'm evading. That's my evade. Okay? I'm evading her. And uh, someone mentioned something now. You saw how much damage I did there? Someone mentioned something with his uh, window for evade. It's a larger window than most. So it makes it easier to evade her special even without being in his, uh, what is it, Nephilim, whatever mode. So you can see I'm getting the decks. I'm not bamfing out um, of his, he's not auto evading in other words, okay? But yeah, we're, we're doing it. If I had him at a higher level, and eventually I will get him up there. Um, oof. She just tore me up right there, but I could see my health just dripping away. So I was just like, yeah, I already know. And she just decided, she's like, I'm not gonna attack. Wait till you attack. And then she intercepted me with her foot. But that's okay. It's all good. Because Nightcrawler is a gentleman. So he's just like, cool. But y'all going down. So here we go again. I'm not too worried about the health potions. I get lots of those. Um, and I know that after this, I'm going to have to deal with the next Winter of Woe. And I saw that pop up. I'm like, no! It did not go away by itself, by the way. I'm sitting here tapping and swiping up. Just so you know. That was a manual removal of that um, notification. But that is the other game that I play called Lords Mobile. Um, but not the game that I was about to play after I finished this off. Uh, that was uh, Albion Online. And in fact, after I make this video, I have, I think, one more video to make. And then I'm going to jump into uh, Albion Online. All right, so here we go. She's, she's getting it. She's getting it. Oh, yeah. He's only got one precision up right now. All right. And see, I can't. Nightcrawler doesn't have a lot of help, okay? So we need to not be getting all that into our block. But you can see, I'm evading. And see, now I'm trying to get some, uh, and I knew she was gonna do that. And then it wouldn't move. I said, all right, whatever. Let's go again. 
And this could have been a much easier, straightforward fight, but I'm getting things done quickly. Not cheaply, perhaps, but quickly. And I will get revives again. I'm not too worried about that. Um, but I wanted to get done. And look at her health. Look at her health. I'm like, yeah, she's at 4%. We got her. We got her. Come on. Hit her with it. Oh, yeah. 2%. Oh, no. Another special. Oh, yeah. Ooh, yeah. Get her. And done. Finally. Smooth. Easy. No problem, right? Anyway, hopefully this helps you guys out. Um, a low level for this uh, Nightcrawler, but could still do it. All right? So take care. Hit the like button. Enjoy yourselves. And you all have a blessed day.